I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Stallions. Today is Wednesday morning, February 13th. I'm Kieran, along with Garrett. And your Stallion News starts right now. <laughs> hey, Stallions. Before we do anything, we want you to remind you to like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you hit that bell icon so you never miss an upload. Top of today's announcements. Attention 7th and 8th grade students. There will be preseason track conditioning tomorrow on Wednesday from 5 4 415 to 545. Meet outside the basketball course and ready to run. You must have a physical on file to attend conditioning or tryout. Track trials will be Wednesday, February 20th and Tuesday, February 21th. Athletes must be on trials at both the days. If you have any questions, please see Mr. Shirak in E104 and Ms. Hilgefort in E117. This Thursday, there is no after school all stars. Please go home on your normal mode of student rotation. Attention 8th grade students, please remember to pay your fees for the 8th grade dance and activities. The deadline is March 15th. You can pay online. Miss Hill will take cash payments at the end of the month. The theme is a black and white affair. We will be collecting new and unused socks to don donate to a local homeless shelter in the Sandy Springs area. Please reminder to bring your fresh socks to the front office or the counseling suit suite anytime this week. We will be collecting socks through Thursday, February 14th. Show some love and bring those socks. Attention students, in celebration of Kindness Week, today you will have an opportunity to say thank you to a teacher, staff member, or an administrator who, are, who has supported you or encouraged you at any time this year. Please make sure to write an encouraging thank you message to your favorite adult today during lunch. On Saturday, SSCMS competed in the Fulton County Regional Science Fair. Kate Zaprunik and Sydney Smith's project placed second in material science. Reese Mundes and Clara Hawkins' project placed first in physics and autonomy. James, James Ballow's project placed first in chemistry. Kendall O'Neill's project placed first in chemistry. All four projects will advance in the Georgia Science and Engineering Fair in March. Winning a special award for the top 10% of all junior division projects was awarded to Kendall O'Neill. She will complete in the Broadcom Masters competition as well. Attention 7th graders interested in taking advanced 8th grade art next year. Advanced art is a semester long high school <laughs> level art class that can earn you high school credit. If you're interested in taking art in high school, this will give you a jump start into their program. Applications are available in their tender or for Mrs. Linningham in room C11 and due March 1st. Space is limited, so please get your application in ASAP. Little ladies will meet tomorrow morning in Miss Goodine's room. Please be in the cafeteria after dismissal. Homeroom teachers, please be reminded to check for all dress code violations. That's all for today. That's all your news for today, Italians. Remember, you're smart, important, and capable. Remember to like, comment, and like, comment, subscribe, and hit that bell icon so you never miss an upload. And always display your stallion pride. <laughs>